Hello everyone! In this video I want to share with you the benefit of ketapang leaves for betta fish. Ketapang leaves are believed to make hickeys free from various diseases, including bacterial infections. This broad leaf plant is also believed to be able to maintain water quality, beautify the skin, and brighten the color of the body. In addition, ketapang leaves can also help prevent fungal infections, diseases, skin, and reduce stress on the hickey. Even for the cultivation process, these leaves can be useful as a place for the hickey to store eggs. The acid in the leaves can kill bacteria and parasites so that the eggs are safe from infection. I will be using the leftovers and storing the rest in a secured sealed container. Why am I using those leftovers? It's because my aquarium are small. How to care for a hickey with ketapang leaves? First of all, prepare to 1525 cm ketapang leaves. Clean it with running water, then put it in the aquarium. This amount is sufficient for an aquarium with 15 minus 50 liters of water. Replace ketapang leaves every two to three weeks to maintain the pH of the water and the health of the hickey. Despite the many benefits, be careful to treat the hickey with ketapang leaves. This is because if the ketapang leaves are not sterile and not properly processed, they will cause danger. Hence, it is important to clean the leaves to their full potential, starting from cleaning the dirt and then soaking the leaves in salt water for about 30 minutes. After that, ketapang leaves can be soaked again in clean water, let stand 24 hours. Then, dry it in the sun for 2 to 3 days to dry. Only then can ketapang leaves be put into the aquarium. After putting the leaf into the tank, it will gradually release substances benefits to fish and shrimps. The water will turn yellowish and eventually light brown. The leaf will sink to the bottom of the tank within 24 to 48 hours and will be softened after a few days, which will also be nutritious organic food for fish and shrimps. This is how it looks after adding the ketapang leaves into your aquarium. I hope this video is beneficial. Thanks for watching.